Hello, it is about 12.15 um, in the afternoon, afternoon or morning. What do you consider that to be? I guess it would be afternoon because it's after noon. Noon is 12 and it is after that, about 15 minutes just about. So it is afternoon. Yeah, not before noon. Afternoon. So we haven't been home long. I took Wayne and we went to his pre-surgery visit and they did an um, echocardiogram and they took some blood, and then they released us. We weren't there very, very long at all. It's another nice day. Today's sunny, though, and it's um, really cool outside, but it's getting warm in the house, so I had to put the air on, even though my windows are still up. But, um, yeah, I went and sewed my brother's thing. See my finger? All of that. A little bit right there, but mainly there. My finger was the pin cushion. I can't wear thimbles. I don't feel comfortable in them. I can't sew in those. So I had to sew loops into his inner boxing glove so he can um, pull the gloves off with a, by the loop. He, um, he had a traumatic brain injury. And um, he is in a wheelchair and he has tremors. His arms shake real bad. And so it's hard for him to do things with his hands. Like, you know, he can't tie laces or, or do anything intricate. Um, and so he needs the loop that he can, you know, hook his finger in and pull his, um, the gloves off because he is working out at the gym and he likes boxing a lot. So he's boxing. I'm really proud of him. And uh, so I sewed that and he and Wayne listened to music because my brother loves music and Wayne loves music. I love music. But I just, you know, like the groove to it. They get into the, all the intricacies of, you know, the the amps and the subs and the speakers and the this and the that. And I just like, if I like it, I like it. And if I don't, I don't. I don't care about all the, you know, what I'm listening to it on. But they do. So they listen to music and I was in the kitchen working on the gloves. We were actually at my brother's longer than we were at the hospital. Now, tomorrow, the hospital will call us and tell us what time to be there Monday for the surgery. And I'm a little, mm, trying not to be nervous about it because that, that fistula thing in his arm with the blood pumping through it is about like that big now. It's really big. And, you know, it's dangerous because if he nicks it, you know, that's blood. That's the, that's the vein thing right there. Oh, yuck. So, mm. so, yeah, he can't do anything with that arm for a month afterwards. No heavy anything, no forceful anything with that arm. And so, yeah, I am going today, maybe, I don't know if my finger wants to or not, do some slow stitching. I'm going to stitch this down to this and start making a cuff bracelet out of that because it's all dry. And... I'm going to finish embellishing because I'm almost finished embellishing. Let me walk over here and get this. Oh, well, I got this first. Let me show you this. That's the sun. Still, it's not showing up. The color is not showing up right. Her face is more yellow than that. That looks like it's barely cream. But yeah, the color is not right on this phone. But I got the back painted. There's the back. And again, it's more vibrant than it looks on this phone. And then there is the sun. I've got to do some work on that. I'm thinking now to put a hoop in this and do this in embroidery. So I might do that in the embroidery stuff. And this is almost completed. I have Went around that whole edge and this whole edge. Well, I'm not even showing you the edge. And back up this edge. And I've got to go across the top. And then this will be done. And I still got to finish. I got one thing to put to that. And I got to finish the paper mache to go on that. So. Hopefully, by the end of today, that should be done. 
and maybe that bracelet will be done that cuff and I don't think that'll be done but I might start working on it but you know it's already afternoon so I don't know how much I'll get done Sky is on his way home he was um, off yesterday and today so he went out of town to see one of his buddies and He's supposed to be grabbing some lunch and then coming home. So he'll be here this evening. So I don't know what'll happen after that. I don't know if there'll be work time or, or what when he gets home. I've already packed his lunch for tomorrow, so that's out of the way. So I'm going to get some stuff done now. I'm getting a really late start in here today. But I want to put on my audio book. I'm listening to uh, The Nicest Couple. I think that's what the thing is. The nicest couple. Are they were really, yeah, the nicest couple. It's really good. I'm enjoying it a lot. And so I want to listen to that. I would put on Outlander because I've been watching Outlander um, on Netflix. But I think I'd rather just finish this audiobook and then go back to Outlander. So anywho. Oh, and I haven't worked on my rug. And you know, I would really like to finish that off well I got a ways to go and my weaving down there is almost done it's halfway done it's probably more than halfway done so I'm pretty stoked to get those projects underway too and I've got some ideas um, for some patches so I want to work on some patches man I got I need to write this stuff down so I don't forget so I'm going to get to work now Thank you for stopping by and seeing what craziness I've got going on. Oh, that's messed up. That'll make me nuts. I just put this here to like keep the sun from fading the sofa in the summer because the sun is intense right there in the morning. It's less so afternoon. Oh, my baby just stood up to get petted. Um, but in the mornings, it's really harsh. And so I don't want it to fade. So I put that right there. And I know the next time I'm in furniture, this will probably move over there. And then, then on my work surface, I'll move over here. We'll see. That day's not this day. I like things like this. I started to move the easel. Just over there. See, there's Cosmo. I started to move the easel into this corner where those drums are. And maybe I should just uncover those drums. But they're just so ugly. They're ugly. They're not pretty at all. But might look better than the cloth. But anyway, I started to put the easel there. If it would fit and I could still open that cabinet. Because this cabinet um, holds a lot of my good stuff. See a lot of my fabrics. And some yarns and felt. So I need to be able to get into that. So this is a pretty crowded corner and, and I do need to access this shelf too because my UV paints are in there. Yeah. We said we need like a 500 square foot house and a 3000 square foot studio. I think he's right. But I make do with what I've got and I like this room a lot. Okay, again, I know I was about to let you go and then I started going in my mouth again that's aggravating I know I'm sorry I'll try to be better at that is that a spider oh no it's a fly on my window okay I see I did it again I digress okay 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 go have a good day and stop by tomorrow and maybe I won't talk your head off but I probably will and I appreciate you so much. Tomorrow might be another late one because if Wayne sees a yard sale for Friday, I know we'll have to go. So, yeah. Anyhow, have a good day. And thank you for hanging out with me again. I appreciate you so, so, so much. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Waving to you, but you can't see me.